I've got the Benelli Velvet and the, the Anthony Building for MOT right now. Uh, you guys know I always get a bit worried about MOT, but it's all good, that's the reality, at least we know it's done. Um, a bit disappointing at the moment that I've got so many cheap, super cheap bikes. I mean, it's good for people out there, it's bad for me. Um, the Peugeot 650, I'm telling you, it's just it's Chinese shit. It's worse than Chinese. Um, the Benelli 650, it's nice, but it just isn't refined enough. And then that new Chinese Cruiser, we just need to do four cable 650. And you might think 612, 18, 1950 is a lot, but actually you take away what you bought for it, you take away all the parts and stuff, and you take away the huge chunk of that profit. The profit is much less. Um, it's silly profit actually, it's maybe £600 max for three bikes. But saying that, it's the game, it's about saving them, it's always been about saving them. So let's get these two out the way. I'm hoping to get the other one done today. Uh, no, done tomorrow. The other Chinese one just needs the throttle cable. I think I do need to fit the cable and run it and just check it over. Um, so yeah, I, we'll, we'll, we'll see. We'll see. Yeah, but we've got three or four bikes uh, looking ready to, to be sold, which is good. Um, selling three or four different bikes is going to be a right pain in the ass. But setting them all at six fifty each should make life a touch easier. There'll be no offers. It'll be come and see it, view it, try it and buy it, or, or go away. Really at 6.50 so full respect to the Maitland guys um, they didn't MOT this he said look there's no point yet the brakes need some work now the front brake pads are pretty much brand new um, so I'm probably going to glaze them a bit but he said the rear as well he said the rear just wasn't doing its thing now the rear is a drum so this shouldn't be I think with the rear I'm just going to put more slack in it i think i, I over tightened it a touch more slack which will give you a bit more bite now he said that the masters are up here oh what happened there yeah look it's not pressing in much it's almost like i need to put a bit of air in there um you know to get more bite so i'm gonna have a little play with this later i'm gonna take the front off i'm sure i've had the front i'm sure i've had it off and given it a clean <sighs> i don't know I'll, I'll get it off, I'll give it another good clean and we'll see what's going on there. But yeah, but it's not, he said the front's not very happy. And the rear um, either. This one's great, done, passed through. Um, he liked it, he liked it, which is rare. He doesn't like Chinese bikes. Um, but he liked it, he said it's, it's a nice build. Um, which it is. I'm gonna get some photos now, put it on the ramp, get some photos, get it up and out. It's gonna be 12.50 set price. And um, yeah, Nerona should um, love it really, because it's a really good bike, it rides really well, it does everything that's needed and asked of it. So uh, I'm happy with that. Oh, busy day today. Right, as far as I'm aware, this thing only needs um, the throttle cable, and then it's a runner rider, I think. I say that and I really don't know actually. So I think, let me pop this off. Let me get the throttle cable sorted. I've got the brand new one up there. I'll put that all on. And then it's gonna be starting and riding. Uh, front brake feels good, although you won't really know until it's uh, on the road. Uh, and then it's a lot of cleaning. I mean, look at these shocks. More bad shocks. Oh, they're bad, they're really bad. Um, I mean, they'll function, but they are not going to clean up. So uh, what we do there, I'm not sure. I don't know how well that will clean up. That will clean up, I'm sure. Um, and the rest is kind of okay. That will shine up nice. The wheels need to clean. The shocks need to front shocks need to clean. Forks, even not shocks, remember forks. Everything else I think is just okay. So let me put the throttle cable on and we'll have a look. Side casings on this are in bad state. At least one is, one's fine. One's in a bad way. One's kind of crumbly in pieces, isn't it, that one? Not really sure what to do with that. I mean, part of me is going to glue it back together and use it. Because um, what can we do? Let's be really honest. Then you've got this. It looks terrible. Look, that will be um, black hammerite on that because there's just nothing else that will um, 
that will do anything. I'll, I'll skim it down, clean it black hammer right. And then uh, everything else is on um, hopes and dreams. Right, let's get the throttle cable on. Let's just see, let's see what it does. Is it a runner rider? What does it actually do at this stage? this cable is oh god it's ridiculous Secondary removed. That's where we want to be. Look how free, how free the cable is. I mean, that's 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 not sticking down. Isn't it? So that's on. I'm just cleaning around the bike now. cleaning products for bikes because I'm very happy to use a little bit of washing up liquid and water which is what I'll put in here after this but I do have to admit this is cleaning well whatever its ingredients is um, it is working well but again I won't pay five six seven pound a time for it uh, this will have washing up liquid and water the problem with washing up liquid is it strips wax so as long as you wax after it then you're fine this is this designed for that so yeah I'll be using tap water after this, but this has been good. I bought it for the car last week.
little bit of fuel to take that off. Just the dribble. Soak it. The basics. There's a lot of slack in this now, but that's that's good really. Um, let's take some out. Let's just see if it starts. Fuel on. So that is choke on. So choke is on now. Where's the key? No horn. No horn again, come on. That started nice. That's off choke now. I'm going to give it two, three, four minutes. I want it to properly warm up. Um, and then I'm going to give, take it for a quick spin and just see what it does. Two, three minutes idling, and then I'll take it up and down the road. Just check what it does. Does it break? Does it engage gear? What does it do? Honestly, it rides so well. 
so well. Um, yeah, wow, okay. It rides really well, really, really well. It's exactly how a bike like that should ride. I'm surprised, it don't make sense really, it looks like shit. 